Hey guys, welcome back to your Daily Dose of Rocket League. Today I have a bit of a story to tell you about a stream I had a couple days ago. Now since I started a second live channel on YouTube, which you should totally sub to by the way if you haven't already, first link in the description, most of my stream highlights or events won't be on my main channel, but this story was way too good not to share this on here. So the other day I started my stream as usual, usually making some sort of map for the game, and this time it was a board game called Catan. If you haven't heard of Catan, it's a pretty great game. I'm really excited to finish it off. It's gonna be really, really difficult to get it all working. This is my first time trying to make a board game in Rocket League, and let's just say it's not gonna be easy easy to make every part of the game work with just using your car. However, things were going pretty smoothly and I was in a great mood. I love doing map making on stream because it's not too high pressure, I can go at my own pace, and it gives me the chance to talk with you guys a little bit more than when I'm actually playing the game. So far you're probably thinking, how does this story have anything to do with the title you clicked on? Well, here's my story of how just a few ranked games afterwards caused me to uninstall Rocket League for the day. Enjoy. <laughs> So after creating most of the board and the interactive portions of the board game on stream the last couple days, I wanted to take a bit of a creative break and jump into some harmless ranked matches. What a shot! Great placement. Oh, I'm gonna- I'm getting a call. I'm getting a call. My ass is vibrating. <laughs> please don't- please don't clip that! Oh! Good job. Holy pinch. Oh, no, that's that's not it, Chief. Oh, teammate didn't want to go. <laughs> okay. What the heck? Oh, score that. Oh! What is that? He's nuts. If he misses... Oh, if I just put that on target, man. Nice shot. I don't think they were going to both miss. Got any more maps in the works? Uh, if you were here just a second ago, you would see... Uh, uh, we're making Catan and Rocket League right now. Ooh. They're both on top of each other. Are they teammates? They are teammates, too. That's so interesting. So if you if you find you're in a lobby where like it's a little bit weird, you're best to just stay patient and find your openings. Like right here after this touch. Like, I haven't had to touch the ball for about a minute. Just do my thing, and then just move out again. Being in the top 100 in 3v3 in solo queuing, I was already pretty prepared for the worst, so I didn't expect too much. It's hard in this game to rotate properly without any communication, since everyone moves so fast and have to make split-second decisions. I'm getting bumped. I'm getting bullied. I'm getting bullied. Teammate, go, go. Oh! <laughs> I'm about to end this man's whole career. Ah! 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 <laughs> I can't! Threes is so bad! Now being around 2100 MMR in 3v3 and jumping into a couple lobbies that were around 1600, not the end of the world, but had me a bit on edge. Nothing against the players, of course, but it's a bit more of an annoyance that Rocket League allows this to happen in less than 5 minute queues. For a bit more perspective, getting into a lobby like this is the same as a champion 3 player running into a lobby with diamond 1s. Anyway, no harm, no foul, I moved on, no big deal. Now this is where the story gets interesting. I decided, hey, you know what, the game's not handing me the best 3v3 games midday here, so let's try some solo queue 2v2 games. This queue took me a bit of time to find, but 2s is a different story. It's much easier to follow than 3v3 since you only have 3 other players to worry about. I think at this point I should just let the game play itself out for the most part, and I'll catch you guys after the gameplay. Cool. Guess I have to, uh... I have to 1v2. I'm 1v3. This is crazy. I'm actually 1v3. What the? F what is happening? He left the game. Let's go. It's actually better that he left the game. One less obstacle. I'm gonna own goal. <laughs> I can see from what, right from the start. I actually don't mind that he left. No, don't bump me. No boost. Don't bump me, please.
No, what is that? I have to be really careful with my touches. Gotta get demoed. Yep. Ugh! They're just starving me. Unfortunate, it was close. Get me out of there. If they weren't demoing me, this would be actually pretty easy because they can't shoot. What is this? <laughs> Where am I right now? Is this hell? What is happening? Guys, where am I? <laughs> where, where am I? <laughs> Bro. What is happening? He's looking for me. Did you get that boost? Oh, I don't want to touch that. It wasn't going to be in. No, it's off the corner. What just happened? I can't go for this. He's in the right spawn. Get me out of this game. I am done. I am done with Rocket League. This game, I'm out. Goodbye. Have a good day. So there you have it. Even at the highest level of this game, there are still trolls, toxic people. It doesn't matter where you are in the game, they'll be there. I guess if there's any sort of lesson to learn here, it's the fact that no matter what rank you're at in this game, we're all still human. We still make mistakes no matter how good we are at the game. So don't think that moving up in the ranks will make anything different for you. The skill ceiling in this game is always accelerating at the moment. And over the past six months, people have been improving drastically. There will always be people in the world trying to ruin your day, but don't let it affect you. Obviously, I'm not done with Rocket League. This was more of a comedic value. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoyed this short little story. If you did, feel free to subscribe. And I love you guys. Have a great day. Peace.